Yeah, I'm gonna wait downstairs for you, okay? All right, see you in a bit. Bye. Hey, Stacy. Hey, Luke. Are you really gonna ignore me right now? Come on, after the way I was treated, I don't even demand the courtesy of awkward conversation. Nope. Well then. You remember this? Luke! Give me that! Ah, hold your horses, Stacy. You'll get this back eventually. Why can't I have my book? It's the last piece of you I have left. That's not up for discussion. You can keep the damn book. In vain I have struggled. It will not do. My feelings will not be repressed. You must allow me to tell you how ardently I admire and love you. What? <laughs> now you want to declare your so-called love for me? I declared my love for you several times over, Stacy, but it never seemed to be sufficient for you. Really? Because I never got more than a half-hearted attempt from you. That's because you want something a different guy can give you. I don't do that prose crap like that Mr. Darcy you does. Are, at least he'd be able to tell me what he was feeling. At least I could actually show you. Because I'm not a freaking fictional character out of a book, Stacy. I know that. Oh, so then you didn't leave me because I'm not enough like your perfect Mr. Darcy. No. Then why? Because I was scared. Scared of what? Scared that you were going to leave me. When did I ever give you that impression? You left me, Stacy, when I needed you the most. What's up, dude? Hey. You alright? Yeah, I'm good. Thanks for asking. Hey, Stace. Here. It's yours anyway. No. It's yours. It, it always has been. Thanks. What happened when I left? Okay, all right, uh... When you broke up with him, mm -hmm. that was the day he found out his mother died. 